I think they're all great. They all come from different championship type pedigrees, former head coach and former NBA players and everything in between. Great trust amongst that staff. You know, that, that staff is a key part of the whole program. And I think that the way they're able to teach is probably what I'm most impressed with, but also how they all help us all hold everybody accountable. But this is effort, okay? We've got effort here. We're doing that as a team. We're holding teams, good teams under 40%. You got that? Take pride in that. Take pride in that, own that. Just go out and compete <coughs> hard. Take away the three in transition, sprint back easy baskets, you win the game. All right? Got you it, got listen, sprint back. understand this. It's not going to be easy. You understand that? It's going to be a fight. So let's fight. Well, I mean, I've been a basketball guy all my life, you know. Obviously, I've been playing basketball since seven, eight years old, uh, so it's kind of in me. And, you know, after playing for 17 years, uh, I, I, I thought the natural progression and transition was to become, you know, even coach. My goal in the office is to make sure that everybody is on the same page for coach and that everybody has the same sense of urgency every single day. Let's get the culture of getting here early. So we're starting at 11, everybody in the building at 10. All right? Everybody in the building at 10. All I want to see is this. Boom! He steps up, he's giving up. He's not, he's getting the air walk. We really like to recruit guys that play multiple positions because then we can share the minutes. You know, just like you're not playing one spot. Um, if you play more than one position, you're gonna be on the court longer and, and kind of like the style we like to play, so. I think we all have the same role. You know, up there, we're trying to become better uh, as coaches and we're trying to get this team to, be, uh, to become better. If you're even with the defender, you attack him. If he's still retreating, you keep moving the ball. But it's got, you gotta shrink the space between you guys. We all have to be uncomfortable in our job. If we're not uncomfortable, we're not getting stuff done. Competing through it and pushing through your comfort levels. If we do that today, we do that every, every day a little bit, we'll be fine, all right? So, you know, upstairs, we, it's kind of the war room and trying to figure out what we need to do so that when we come down here, we prepare these guys to be the best players they can be. And for our kids, I'm probably the guy that's not very nice to them. I'm prone to push them harder than anybody else because I know what it takes to get you to the other level, and I'm not gonna let you make any shortcuts. Every time they step on the court, you want to get the most out of them. And uh, just push them and prepare them every day. There's a lot Perry for the dunk. He's trying to be an example for our guys, uh, family-oriented role models for our players, and, and um, you know, try to put South Florida on the map. Ultimately, each day is to try to be a better person and to try to gain as much as you can so that you can give to your to your student-athletes.